Hello and welcome to Short Thoughts, a commentary channel where we take a look at things happening on the internet and give a short, unedited reaction based opinion on the topic at hand. Today we're going to be talking about Susie Liu, a YouTuber with over 375,000 subscribers, going in the negative direction. Her channel resists. Resist. Uh, resist, huh, resist. Her channel consists of reaction based content where she sits there and reacts to various different things without actually reacting. Yeah. So she's quite notorious. Over a year ago, she was blasted into the spotlight by a few smaller YouTubers for copyright striking a guy called Mark After Dark after she claimed that he used her face and that she owns the copyright to her face, which is not true. You can't own the copyright to your body. You can own a copyright to a photo, but not your face. As well as this, his work was fair use so she falsely took it down since then nothing's happened however it came out that two years ago she was exposed by many news organizations for being a douchebag on twitter saying that mcdonald workers should actually get get, any, get a decent job get a decent job it's not like they're doing doing work whereas you just sit there reacting to other people's work and get paid for it nice she also has a website now which is basically she uploads the exact same she does on youtube except that she has her own personalized ads so she gets more money that way on work that's not hers she doesn't own the copyright to it so it's copyright infringement we've made contact with the relevant authorities on that matter so don't worry so why is she popular now? Huh, popular, more like notorious. Well, Susie has a history of not liking criticism and calls anything that slightly calls her out for a bullshit hate videos. A man called Tips, the news channel, and a good social commentator on the website and anything happening has been a victim of her censorship. Last year, he was one of the people who got flagged by Susie for covering the Mark After Dark situation, and she stupidly shooed, she, sorry, stupidly shown everyone her flag history on a live stream with multiple people calling her out. After she walked a dog, that took about an hour. She's an idiot. There's not much going on in that massive forehead. So recently, she's also flagged Tipster again. And he received a community guideline strike for his coverage on her shithousery. So that prompted into action Mr. John Swan, who released a video basically slam dunking on her and everything she has done from last year through to now. This video was very well received and it got many people talking, including a lot of bigger YouTubers who have accumulated over 2 million views in total on this situation. Not a very good thing for Susie, so what she decides to do is the opposite of what any sound-minded individual would do. She filed a flag against John's video, and it got taken down for bullying and harassment, because apparently telling people that you're doing bad things is... Hurty feelies times. So basically all John had to do was uh, re-upload the video, censor it, and explain why he's re-uploading the video, and it's probably going to get double the views and double the coverage. So in doing so, Susie has kind of ruined any chance of anyone forgetting about this. The Stride Sound effect is in full swing. Self-regulation on YouTube is coming in clutch, and she's going to be held accountable because many people are going to get into contact with the copyright holders that she is stealing from. And there is no way she can say that her work is fair use. Because if you go to her Patreon, she uploads full unedited videos where she gets people to pay them. Pay her $5 a month to watch. If we actually go to her Patreon. Wrong one. Patreon. 
five dollars per month to watch these these are all unedited anime reactions because that's what she says on her website she has 110 it doesn't actually say how many patrons she has but apparently at one point she was making nearly 10 grand so you get the point will she get sued maybe will she get a cease and desist probably Will she get terminated on YouTube? Well, she should, because she's already been terminated for the exact same thing. But, who knows? All I do know is that this is not over. This has only just begun, and Susie Lou, Yeah, fucked. And that concludes today's short thoughts. I hope you enjoyed. If you did so, like, subscribe. And I'll see you next time, when I have a thought about something. Bye.